Good morning. Well, when this was a prison, we might have been shot if we got this close to Alcatraz on a boat. Here on San Francisco Bay, it was thought the cold water, the currents, and strong tides made escape from the prison impossible. But for 55 years, a mystery has lingered. Did three inmates actually escape and survive? Ever since brothers John and Clarence Anglin, along with inmate Frank Morris, disappeared from Alcatraz in 1962, the official story has been they didn't make it. The Federal Bureau of Prisons say that they drowned once they got off of Alcatraz and, and their bodies were swept out to the Pacific Ocean. But now, a letter obtained by CBS affiliate KPIX claims all three lived well into old age. My name is John Anglin, the letter begins. I escaped from Alcatraz in June 1962. Yes, we all made it that night, but barely. Anglin's cell is now a favorite stop for tourists who can see the vent he squeezed through when he and the others made their break, then floated off the island in a homemade raft. The letter makes an offer. If you announce on TV that I will be promised to go to jail for no more than a year and get medical attention, I will write back to let you know exactly where I am. It adds, I am 83 years old and in bad shape. I have cancer. If the three did survive these treacherous waters, as the letters claim, they would have outlived the prison. Alcatraz closed in 1963, the year after the escape. But the mystery remains open. Good morning. Well, when this was a 